Okay. December 16, 2010 last night. Here's one of my container gardens. And this is another one of my container gardens. This one's got um, sweet peppers, the banana peppers, I seem to recall. Let's have a look here. Long yellow capsicum. There we go. But we've got a bit of water laying there. Got to do something about that. The chooks got into this one. And that's um, what's left the remnants of a lettuce. I've got uh, strawberries that I've planted. I've got a hot chili that I've planted. And I have got another strawberry, different variety. Over here, we have got a tomato. Um, that's a brandy, a beefsteak type. Over here, uh, another cherry tomato. Over here, uh, I think that's Nonna's uh, tomato. This one here is um, a cherry tomato, a sweet cherry. And this one here is um, a um, Amish paste. So just uh, switch this around and uh, say a few words. Um, driving a spike through the drainage holes that uh, are clearly clogged. Um, I've rearranged the partridge and the um, uh, pheasant because the pheasants were attacking the partridge. Um, so it was a good thing I had a spare cage available. Uh, so that's another tip. Always have that one extra space just in case. Um, 16th of December, another week, 23rd of December, and we are halfway through our growing season here. Um, unlike parts of North America, this area of the world that I live in has um, about 122, 123 days between the first frost and the last frost, and then 246, I believe, days until um, the first frost again. So I've got a 240-plus day growing season. Coming up on 120 of those um, gone. Um, and uh, I have um, that's not quite right because uh, it's 123 days, if I count it correctly, until the end of shed work. So, um, just a quick one in terms of John discovering what chooks are. Um, yes, that's what we call chickens. Chickens here uh, tend to be the little baby ones, uh, and hens and chooks are the pullets and um, laying hens or our meat chickens, our meat birds. Um, so, and the worst thing you can wish on an Aussie is that his chooks turn into emus and not as lawn green calls them emus. They are emus. They have big feet, they slice people open and they make a mess of your dunny door. Anyway, on that happy note, uh, make sure your containers have got uh, Granny tolls and um, uh, don't do what I did. Uh, stay safe, everyone.